The chances have been there, they've been quality chances, but the team unable to score goals, it's been hurting them. Martins able to sidestep a hit, now Schultz to the back, hit cutting into the shot, he scores! What a move! Jesse Schultz, who didn't have a point in his last three games, in his first shift, breaks that drought. Thank you, Fred Brathway. At one end of the ice, just a spectacular stop, and how many times has the puck moved up the ice and a play is made and the team, after making a stop, comes up with a big goal. What a dodge of a huge hit. Stevie Martins, and he throws the puck across. A beautiful feed, and Jesse Schultz has talked about this in traffic. Boy, is he good. He can pull and drag it with the best of them, and he's able to do that. Very nice move on Hambly. Goes around and goes top shelf. Oh! Grabs at the side of the net, but Prog with a shot, rebound, and oh. Lavalli with a tap in. The power play comes through with the Wolves with an early lead. A valid point, Pat, was made by you. The perimeter passing was good, yes, and the control was okay, but there was nobody in front of the net, so there was nothing developing until Jordan Lavalli went to the front, and he took some punishment early on. Stayed in that vicinity after a nice little block. Krog gets it back, goes back to the point. Fahey fakes, goes back to Krog. He's going to take his time. He's going to watch things develop in front. Both guys go to the front of the net. And a nice play by Oystrick actually to separate, coming in from the right point and draw some attention as he goes through the seam. That opens it up for Krog. His shot is on target. And Jordan Lavalley, who wasn't. Rules with their second early power play. Krab goes down, low centering pass. Oh, Oystrick! He scores! Nathan Oystrick! Two power play goals for the Wolves early on. They've got a 3 0 lead. What a pass! Beautiful feed. Jason Krog head up all the way, and this shot, it's really a weak shot, it's labeled between the legs, the butterfly Lalonde shows has a gaping opening, stick not down, and uh, it finds the target. Very nice feed though, through a seam, no one in the right position to get the sticks down and maybe intercept the play, Oystrick, he did it earlier, Self a good chance. You noted this, here's a great move around a check, oh, it's a ball, good good vision, then he did! He was initially denied by Lalonde, and DeVoe got it back. Perseverance leads to the fourth goal. How about those hands? Andre DeVoe, some Poland dragon. I'll tell you, there's a lot of fishing going on here, and it's not a very nice river. And the ice is solid, and the guy's just looking down at the feet and the puck. Kevin Dole with a puck is going to get stripped away, and then the Poland drag. <laughs> wow, what a play around Ramholt. And then to the back end, and Pat mentioned it looked like he loses it, but his long reach stays with the puck, and his ability to throw those arms out and recapture the puck and send it back in as Kevin Dole's on the doorstep also. Just a beautiful play. Looks like he surprised himself, <laughs> didn't he? <laughs> Joey Crab, stick handling. Now looks for Jason Krog. On the line is Lavalli! He scores on a play. All three on the line. Figure that one. Lavalli to the back end with a finisher. But both Crab and Krog really made it happen. They did. Composure. Joey Crab had good control and is just razzling and dazzling everybody along the right side of the boards. Backhand does the right thing. There were some openings to the back, but instead of going out in the middle of the ice, he makes sure by going down low to Krog. And what a play by Krog. He'll pull and drag to Jordan Lavalley. No one around Lavalley all the time in the world. And what a move he makes to the backhand. No chance. Picks the same year. Keely Amelon. Here's Schultz, he scores. Loose puck all of a sudden wound up on Jesse Schultz's blade. Bang, his second of the game. And it's 6-1. You see the way Jesse Schultz shoots the puck and the ability to put it in places. And you wonder why last year he had such a tough year offensively after having 37 the year prior, 38. On his stick, bit of a giveaway. And he parts it top shelf. Malone will go down, giving the roof, and he finds it. Oh, he's got now a giveaway to Jesse again to the forehand. And he puts one. Oh, he missed score. How did that go in? That looked like a changeup, and Jesse Schultz with two goals in 12 seconds and has three in the game. First of all, very patient with a puck. He waited it out. Got Lalon to drop down, then didn't have a lot of room or time. Put it towards the goal. I'm not sure if we have an angle. I'm not positive that the puck didn't go in without the help of a Flames player. The move, holding, holding, sliding. Oh, it was going in, but it looked like it might have hit Pellick on the way by. 